If you've ever tried background remover apps, you already know most of them either mess up the edges or make the image quality really bad. In this video, I'm testing an AI app that claims to remove backgrounds cleanly and add realistic AI backgrounds with proper lighting and depth in just a single click. So without further ado, let's dive in. So first of all, I open the Play Store on my phone, then I search for Nero BG Remover, and this is the app that you need to install. I already have it installed, so I simply open it. As soon as you open the app, you get a very simple and clean interface like this. Here, you can see options such as Remove Background, AI Background, AI Cutout, and Magic Eraser. Apart from this, at the bottom, you'll find some basic templates that you can use to change the background. After that, there are also some colors available if you want to add a single solid color to the background of any image. Along with colors, there are many gradients available as well, which you can easily use as a background. Now, let's try removing the background of an image. I click on Remove Background. Here, you get two options. Choose from Photos and Use Camera. When I click on From Photos, my phone's gallery opens. From here, I select this image of a girl. When I click on Done, the app automatically starts analyzing the image, and within just a few moments, the background is completely removed. By clicking on this icon, you can compare the before and after results. When I zoom in, you can clearly see that the background has been removed very cleanly and accurately. At the bottom, you get the same options that I mentioned earlier, such as Colors, where you can choose any color as the background for your image. There are also many gradients available, and you can apply whichever gradient you like to your image. There is an outline option as well. If you want to add an outline of a specific color around your image, you can do that. And you can also increase or decrease its size according to your preference. When I click on the image option, you can add any image as a background. For example, I have applied this image as the background here, and you can adjust its size according to your main image. Apart from this, AI backgrounds are also available. There are some really good background options specifically designed for product images. But since my image is not a product image and instead features a girl, I select this white wall background. After a short loading time, you can see that this background has been added to my image. When I click on Continue in Editor, I get a full preview of the image. You are given two variations, and you can choose whichever one looks better to you. When I zoom in on the image, you can see that because this background was added using AI, it looks completely natural, and the lighting of the image has also been automatically adjusted. By clicking on the Save button at the top, I save this image to my device. Apart from this, you can also blur or crop the background of the image. Now I close this and let's try adding an AI background to a product image. For this, I click on AI background and then tap on Try Now. From the gallery, I select this image of shoes. After waiting for a few moments, the background has been removed. Now, when I click on the plus icon, a lot of AI background templates appear that you can use. I select this concrete background. The loading has now started, and you can also minimize it by clicking on the exit button. As you can see, the loading section has now appeared at the bottom, where our results will be shown. Okay, the background has now been added, so we click on it. Here again, you get two variations, and you can choose the one that looks better. As you can see, the background looks completely natural. By clicking on the edit icon, you can further edit it, meaning you can add any custom background of your choice. I remove this text and type something myself. I keep it very short, for example, wooden table, warm interior. When I click on generate, you can again see that the backgrounds have been generated according to the prompt I provided. After clicking on continue in editor, here is the final result. I think this background looks very natural and professional. I save it to my device and then close it. The next option is AI cutouts. Here, I upload this image of a boy. This is basically an AI cutout feature. From the bottom, I increase the brush size, and then I randomly select the boy in the image. When I click on cutout, the app detects whatever I have selected in the image, and then it removes everything else from the image in this way. You can use this feature in images that have multiple objects where you only want to keep a specific selected object. So, this is the Nero AI Background Remover app, which allows you to remove and change backgrounds in high quality. The link to this app is in the description. Make sure to try it. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel to watch more useful videos like this every day.